I can't believe I got fired on my day off. What? How you get fired on your day yeah. off? I don't know. Oh I thought, God. I thought, it was, I don't know. That's wow. all I got to say. That's crazy. Look at me. Hi, Danny. Hey, bro, what up? Hey, guys, what's up? What are y'all doing? Boy, we just came over here to see what you're doing. Nah, I'm chilling. What about y'all? Boy, as hell, man. <laughs> that sucks. Me and Angie just got back together, though, so, you know. For real? Yeah. How's she doing? She's good. She's at some rally protesting something. What are they protesting? I think the war. Uh... So Danny, I bet you and Angie got some plans tonight, huh? No, not really. Probably gonna watch a movie or something. Yeah, okay. Hey, y'all seen that new iPhone that came out? Yeah, look, check it out. Look. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, I, okay, I got my phone is raggedy. So didn't you guys catch a state of the union last night? Oh, when the president was like on six different channels? Yeah. I caught part of that. He was talking about the crisis overseas. Oh my God, did you hear what he said he was gonna do? Mm. Oh, about healthcare? Yeah, and I think he made all them promises to making healthcare cheaper and better. And now this, God help you if you get sick these days. I know, ain't that crazy. I don't know, I don't follow that stuff. Well, you should. Not it really. affects you. No, no, not really. I just sit back and let somebody else take care of it. See, that's a problem nowadays. Too many people think like that. They feel it's okay to just sit back and let somebody else take the action. I mean, even if it's something they don't agree with. Whatever, I don't care. Hey, Danny, what would you do if you was president? The first thing I'll do is nuke any country that threatened us. Then, I'll obtain the top three generals from around the world to be my personal advisors and approve the construction of a satellite-based death ray. You can't do that. That's terrible. Hey, who's president? Yeah, you definitely got my vote. Not mine. That's terrible, Danny. If you're president, I call you President Evil. <laughs> and if you're president, I'd be a superhero. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and the first thing I do is come after you, stupid. First, I destroy your little death ray. So you won't be able to hold the world at gunpoint anymore. Then, I head to Washington to take you down. You'll be on the phone issuing a red alert to your troops. But I ain't beat down anyone who stood in my path. Hey baby, what took you so long? Yeah, we are starting to think you was gonna show. You should've wished it. I began destroying your bodyguard assassins. Using one of them as a club to beat the again. other one. Then, as you begin to sense defeat, you make a run for your escape pod. But you wouldn't make it in time. I'd lift you up by the back of your shirt and take you to jail, where you spend the rest of your days making license plates. Then I file a police brutality report on you. But I'm not a cop, I'm a superhero, and I'm allowed to do that. See, whatever. Nevaeh, why you never thought about going to art school? I mean, you're constantly drawing. No, oh, I don't think I'm nearly good enough for anything like college. Girl, what are you talking about? You're like the best artist I know. You know, you shouldn't doubt yourself. You can do anything you put your mind to. And I've seen your work, and it's really good. Oh, thanks, but I don't think it's good enough for something like that. Well, you better figure out something, because I already got my whole life planned out. I'm going to have a nice crib. Some nice furniture. Some artwork on the wall. A big screen TV. A butler. And a couple of girls. That's all a lot of me. Hold on, hold on. How do you expect to achieve all this? 
I'm going to be a rapper. <laughs> That's funny, because I always pictured you doing something else. Man, that's not funny. So, Andrea, what are you going to do? What do you mean? What are you going to do over the next couple of years? Oh, well, after high school, I'll probably go to college. I mean, I've been checking out different schools, but I haven't really decided which one I want to go to yet. I'll probably get a student loan and go to a university here in state. I mean, you know I'm not going to give up on my singing career, but I'll have four years working my style and my voice while pursuing my career. That sounds real hard. I know, but nothing's gonna be handed to me in life, right? True. Oh my God, I gotta go, guys. I'm gonna be late. I'll see y'all later. Oh, bye, Andrea. Trick.